Hello and welcome back to the Generator God playthrough. And yeah, so we're continuing to play. And Dragon went for a break. He's become an exterminator. He's eating. So let's see. They're all crowding around the Generator God as if it's going to make any difference if we <laughs> watch it or not. <laughs> Well, to be fair, we have actually made quite a big difference in the last, well, half an hour. Uh, that's true. I think in half an hour we've gone up maybe four or five megawatts. Yeah. Mm. If you look at, like, the past ten hours even, it's uh, it's quite a quite jump. It's very nice. Yeah, if you, if you put it on the one hour time, uh, I think we've gone up about a third extra power in in half an hour. Yeah, so fair. Very good. But yeah, we're using up like everything. Like, not a lot is like backfilling. No, it's an angry, it's a not angry, but uh, how do you say it? It's a greedy god. Well, in fact, I think it's very generous. Like, we are the greedy ones for using more power than it will be able to give us, right? <laughs> so. I'm gonna, I'm gonna dump in a crap load of stack inserters because stack inserter is like 800 uh, points with something uh, have we got loads of stack inserters spare in which case I'll use them to um, increase our resource flow from oh. the outpost first uh, the last time I checked the outposts uh, they are actually not backing up so the inser inserters are keeping up fine uh, okay. un unloading, I already did the, the sensible thing. <laughs> right, I'm uh, I'm gonna go to bed in a bit, guys. I'm gonna go. Mm. It's been yeah. an absolute pleasure, but uh, yeah, see you uh, see you later. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I Good think night. it's gonna be the last episode for today's session, so. We can sure. all go to sleep in like 20 minutes. <laughs> right. Good night, guys. Good night. So 34.3 megawatts and something 118 in stack inserters. So Yeah, it gave more than the megawatt. I'm back, what happened? I fed 118 stack inserters into the generator. This is gonna be the last episode for today's recording session. Alright, how long left? Mm, about 20 minutes, a little bit less. I'm thinking when to do the next uh, session recording. No. Ah. Probably not tomorrow.
advanced circuits. Need to go catch some advanced circuits. <laughs> yeah, our I ate so so many green electronic cir circuits that uh, our copper copper is liking right now. That's not helping, Sai, you're just wasting them. Upgrading... Oh, yeah, that helps a little, but the machines were not the bottleneck, though. They were already operating at maximum. Mm -hmm. But you checked that before you made a bunch of expensive things, right? Right? Of course not. Oh yeah, the stone outpost is hooked up. I'm really surprised how long Iron One outpost has lasted. Mm, uh, because it's 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 actually quite spread out. It's so it's set up for maximum time. You could basically yeah. almost double its production. Mm, maybe not double, but like. 50, 60 percent more. Yeah. <coughs> now what? Actually, in our situation, this would help. Yeah, if you need red circuits, bring some copper with you. Mm, it's run out of copper. Why did we expand the production of the engines so much? Like three or four episodes ago, I think? Been like that for a long time. Mm. Actually, it's... Uh, I think someone expanded it a little bit more. Oh, or it's the... Oh, it's flame turrets. Okay. Yep. Yeah, we just have a huge engine backup. I know. Mm. But if you take all the engines now as you're doing, that steel will be consumed and not be put in to make flame uh, torture. Yeah, I know, but that's a lot of engines. I'm gonna dump them into Generator God because 
<clears throat> we need power more. Let's see how much difference we would make. So 35.6 and drop all the engines. Yeah, not much. Yeah, basically at this point the only thing we can do is wait, honestly. Maybe, yeah. maybe speed up the game? Nah, that's cheating. Eh, we did it anyway, but it's, it's just wasting time. I'm gonna dump the engines in, but do a bit of circuitry so that it'll only dump the engines in if there's enough resources to make flamethrower turrets. Mm. That makes sense? Oh gee. <laughs> Cheating much? Well, what's this, six times speed? Ten times. Ten. And we're gaining like 0.1 megawatt every 5 to 10 seconds. It's not worth it, Sias. Yeah, oh! But, but at least we are getting something. Yeah, but when bugs attack <laughs> mm. at this speed. Yeah, yeah. just. Sias, don't do like that. That's cheating, it invalidates everything. It's not cool, it's not fun. Because if you're gonna do that, you might as well set one miner to make, uh, I don't know, landfill, and then put game speed 500 for an hour. You remove the challenge. Mm hmm. Okay, what's. Uh... What's up I need here? to hear a yes, sir, from that one. Uh, why are we missing coal? Follow the lines. Oh, someone... <clears throat> someone derped hard. Where's the issue? Yeah, someone forgot to add um, a one section of belt, so it actually goes to the undergrounds. So we actually had our... <clears throat> Half of our smelting not working. And that's why that design for fuel is not a favorite of mine, because it's so finicky. If you would have the uh, underground belts with fuel all the way dead, I would have much preferred that because it's easier to see where how everything is connected. But. Eh, that's just... Yeah, I cannot wait to, till we get the upgrade planner in, in point seventeen. Yeah. 
Yeah. Al although we do not have bots and the the one in the vanilla game will require bots to work. Yeah, I agree, but from what I've seen you doing, Sias, you're upgrading things that are not bottlenecked by Bell. Uh, not really, but... I don't know. It, it's gonna recover faster. If something goes um, wrong. Yeah, but this is not a fully public game. Most players here are fairly competent. So, you know... <laughs> Unless you plan on fucking it up, Sias, it's not an issue. I actually wanted to. <laughs> Need more. What? Electronic circuits. I was just trying to work out why I couldn't do this. We haven't even researched uh, circuit network yet, have we? Nope. Mm. <coughs> <coughs> Is it actually even close enough? We can just research that immediately. Oh yeah, circuit network. Uh, did I put batteries on res- Oh, you- you changed it from... Yep. Why? Because battery is a very high res- for very low cost item that gives a lot of points. Almost 80 for one iron and one copper. And some sulfuric acid. We're going to need some more defense by the stone. They're being overwhelmed. Consumers. Because the power was in the green for some time. Well, we're doing science, remember? Mm. Mm, yeah, actually. You know, every now and then I got this sneaking suspicion you're not paying attention. Mm. Well, I just. Well, I've been streaming for six hours, so I, my attention is getting Excuse. a bit hazy. <laughs> and he's dying of man flu. <laughs> well, he's been back and forth on that one, so I'm not so sure. His story keeps changing. The story keeps changing, yet the cough stays the same. Yes, generic cough. Yeah, oh, it's dying. Oh, stone outpost. I'm on my way. Oh, there's actually big biters now. So, two turrets is not enough. You need, like, probably four, six turrets and a wall around them. Preferably double sided. What you should do is push back a little so you can have better positions to attack and defend from. Now, I'm gonna play some radar icon on the map, uh, where you should expand to see how it looks. Because maybe, find that you can take over an area complete. Because there's a few areas here that would be very, very good to defend. Just 
of main base, there's a very small area there that would be reasonable to defend. And around the stone patch, there's just a lot of things there could very live in his plan. A bit hard to tell, but could be. Well, while I don't disagree with you, I will be sleeping very short. That sounds like a sense of human thing. <laughs> Oh, uh, by the way, do you have, like, some belt stuff? Yeah. Alright. Um, you, if you could take output from the left topmost splitter and merge that to the rightmost train loading... Yeah, that's so good. Um... That's, I, oh, yeah, yeah. Go, so uh, from there and in here. I got you. Yeah. I run to the almost to the oil outpost and realized I do not have any copper, <laughs> so no red circuits. Damn it! Yeah. So when are we gonna record next time? When? When you can come? Uh, I would prefer not tomorrow. Oh, well, yeah, tomorrow is not really a good option. Then it should be fine. Uh, we should pick a day so uh, we can notify everyone who was today here. Yeah, but do that tomorrow. It's late. Hmm. So you can post uh, my event general and ask me just, hey, uh, people that joined today, you could make a note of when you are available, and if not, we'll take a date from whoever is responding. Well, I, I can do an, any evening, um, starting 8 o'clock my time. Uh, although actually on the weekend, on the work day, it's probably going to be more 9. <clears throat> 9, so it's 6 o'clock UT, UT, UTC time. So it's 7 in England, 8 Germany, Norway, 9 for me. 9, 9, 9! But I'm not gonna be able to play for that long. Probably like two hours for free. And in completely unrelated news, I added way more. Um, mm -hmm. Flamethrower <laughs> turret thing. Yeah. We actually, like, we actually, in the last hour, we pushed our power quite heavily. Yeah. Yeah, it's doing well. It was very necessary. Yep. But we are also dedicating a mu much more machine time and power to more power. But that's good. Yeah. Yeah, and on that note, let's wrap the episode for today. So. Thank you everyone for watching, uh, we're gonna continue to play in this map, uh, so see you next time, bye bye!